Hi, good morning. Today is June 2nd and I'm outside. I have a project I have to, to do today. Um, my passenger side mirror broke. Uh, some plastic that was connected by a screw broke away from the screw. So I have it. I have a replacement part and I need to get this done today because it's supposed to rain tomorrow. Okay, so this is my mirror and you can see I've I've uh, temporarily secured it so I could get back and forth to work. But I gotta take this off and uh, okay, so you can see I've got it temporarily secured and I have to take the cloth off, or the string off in order to show you what happened. Okay, so this basically is what happened. It broke away somewhere here, or right here. It broke away from the screw. So I've got a replacement, a replacement mirror that I'm going to install today. Okay, so my husband bought me this and I found the tool that I needed it oh I can't see that I need my glasses um, it's a it's got a 10 on it this will tell me 10 millimeter and He sent me a video, so the guy showed you pop this out, and I have to take those out. So I cannot hold the camera and do this at the same time, so I'm going to take these out and get, get going on it. Maybe I can show you. They're loose, so now we're going to take them out. Sorry for my big hands in your way. That one I need to do a little more. Hold on. I hope I'm not making you dizzy. This thing is going all over the place. Okay, I need to set you down because I need to use both hands. Okay, screws are out, and as you can see, the mirror is now hanging. Whoa. Okay, let me come around. All right, we got the we got it off. It's hanging. Now I have to do something else. There's something. Oh God. Okay, I need to find out. All right, you can see right here. This piece also broke off. It was just inside here. Okay. So I have to take the 
the panel on the inside out. And the video says take out that screw and then I have to remove this and take out another screw. Gotta get back up. <clears throat> okay, so I popped it out. The other screw is... I don't know if you can see it, but it's... It's right here. It's right in here. So I'm gonna set you down and take it out. loose I'm just finishing it all right it's out now I gotta take it off this really sucks not having my tripod let me hold you down again okay I got it released oh gross all right, now I got to deal with all the plastic. Okay, so I had to go get some scissors so I could get into this plastic. The plug is, I guess, right in here. I don't think you can see it, but it's it's right in here. You can feel it. So I'm supposed to disconnect. I got the right one. And I'm losing the door. Okay. Let's go back around here. Okay, I had to cut the plastic again. I wanted you to see there's the plug right there. And now I still got to get it out. Okay, this is the new window. And I need to check the plug in it so I can see what the other end looks like because I'm trying to figure out how to get it out. I know it's not that hard, but I need to see. Okay, that's, I think it's what's holding me is right there. Okay, I wish I could show you the whole thing, but it's taking two hands. You had to press this little lever part here, right here, down in order to pull this off. And I couldn't see. Anyways, it's off. Now we're going to take out the old mirror. Put in the pretty new one. All right. I am trying to do this while holding a camera at the same time. Let me, okay, I've got it held on temporarily by a, a nut, so we're going to oh, find the 
other side. Right here. And put this back. Put it back in here. Still trying to keep the camera in position while I do this, but I don't think I'm going to have any luck, so I'm going to put you down again. Okay, she's in. Now put this thing back together. And put the plastic back up. I temporarily got it, the uh, door back in over here to hold it and still have this loose. So I've got the, I've got the bolts on but not tight. So I'm getting ready to do that. It's just holding the mirror in place. Let me find my tool and switch this this way. Whoops. Um, yeah, let me let me take this big part off. Okay, let's see if we can get these back on. And there goes the door. Okay, I got it. All right, tighten that just a little bit more by hand. I'm trying to get the stuff done before it gets too hot because I mow, I'm mowing the yard and I don't want to do this in the heat. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. And then I have to finish planting my garden. I've got some watermelon that needs to go in the ground. And I've got some more tomatoes to go in the ground. I have a some squash that I want to get in the ground. And I'm finding I don't get enough time now to do it all. And so let me tell you a story. Yesterday at work... My boss and her husband went home the day before and found on the road four puppies that somebody had dumped. They look like they have some German Shepherd in them. Anyways, they're cute as can be. Um, I wish people would either get their animals fixed or not have them at all if they can't be responsible. It's really cruel to be um, dumping your animals. I can't, I, I don't understand people how they can be so selfish. If you don't want to deal with a litter, then have your animal fixed. Anyway, so let me put this, that's just my rant. Let me put this door back on. Oops, okay, so the door panel's back on. That was fun. So now we have to t put in the, the two screws back in here. And back under the door handle. Let's see if I can do that and show you. Maybe not. All right. Okay, I've got this one in. I've got this one in. Now we're doing this one. I feel like if I used a tripod, you still wouldn't be able to see what I was doing. And even though it's needing two hands, and I don't think that's going in. Oh, there it goes. Okay. And then pop this back down in there. Uh, 
and that's done. Now I'm going to go get the keys so we can test the mirror. It didn't fall yet. I don't need to do that. You coming in? We're not going anywhere. We're not going anywhere, sweetie. Okay, this car is falling apart. Look at there. It works. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you change a mirror in your car for this particular model. Okay, so the mirror is replaced, everything's back together, and the educational process for me is done. It's hot and sweaty, and I just want to go back inside and cool down. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and comment down below, and I hope that somebody out there has learned something. Thanks. Bye.